prioritized aerials. I don't know if that's how it was. I but um, in four, he had no prioritized smashes. He had no prioritized aerials. It was really tough, but he was still good. He was still really good because he tacked on damage like nobody else in the game. Yep. Um, and it's still that way. Uh, even when you look at characters like Inkling that can do a bunch of damage through Ink, Olimar is just consistently hurting you. You're just... You're it's like, it's annoying too because even if you do hit the Pikmin off, you're throwing out moves that are punishable. Yeah. So they literally do that to you, and while you're like distracted trying to get rid of the Pikmin, they get like a free grab or like something, a free whip punish. Oh, yeah, and the Pikmin actually, it's worse because the Pikmin extend the hitboxes. So it's like on the on the negative side in this game, they're much easier to kill because uh, Pikmin have non regenerative health. So I think in, uh, in four, Blue Pikmin had like 13 to 15 health. Um, and if you, you took like 7% off of that Pikmin, it wouldn't go away. It he would stay that way. Uh, but they're very easy to kill now. Uh, but if you try to like nair a Pikmin off of you, it's going to extend that nair by a couple of frames. Ooh, good parry. So we got some more good and representation on the stream here. This time coming off from Paper Soul Power Representative. Actually won on Thursday for his first tournament here at Esports Arena. Oh yeah, I really like Paper. I, I, I really like uh, the way that he plays Game & Watch. Uh, Taternator too. Uh, they're both... Uh, sorry, not Taternator. Uh, Trickmaster, yeah. Both start on the team. But yeah. Uh, uh, showing to work on Iron right now. Yeah. Showing a little bit of that weakness we talked about. Yeah, the showing landing. The land. Some tough stuff. Ooh, okay. But uh, the thing is, once Alma gets to the ground, he has all the tools to just really even up the game. So. And he has those yellows now, too. He has two of them in the lineup, so it's going to be oh. very easy to link up uh, aerials. Yeah, so Paper, like, once he has uh, I'm in a bad spot, you need to keep him there, because it does not take much for him to bring it back. As you can see right now, already in the percent lead, he's got two purples on deck. Ooh, no back air. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> blue up throw is OD in yeah. this game now. It, it was bad in four, but it's worse now. It, oh, it, it would have killed Game & Watch at like 80. Yeah, Game & Watch, being like as light as a feather or two doesn't help at all with this Pikmin lineup you have here. Oh yeah, both these characters are very light. Oh, uh, yeah, I mean, he's, he's got he's got some stars in his lineup. I mean, besides the white, which he doesn't really need anymore, uh, um, that, that... This is icing on the cake, honestly. Dead. Super dead. <laughs> yeah, every, like, every throw is a kill throw with Olimar, except for down throw. Yeah, having that, uh... Having like a oh wow, jab block. <laughs> yeah, having, having a arsenal that does so much damage as a player that's super light like game watch is so good. Yeah, it's true, it's true. I'm seeing right now, paper hasn't really put uh I'm hip and disadvantage since we started like that first stock. Like as soon as they've been on the ground, it's been all I'm hip. I think this fair actually might come into to use and that bucket too, because you're able yeah. to just deflect the Pikmin. Oh, okay, up B, punishing. Yeah, he's a do a little bit more to keep I'm here from just camping him out because the more he stays on the ground and gives him all the space in between, the better he is for I'm here. Yeah, whiffing that back air is definitely going to cost him hit though. Ooh, just throwing all the Pikmin at him. Okay. Yeah, look at all the damage he took. Yeah. It's Already that kill percent again. Mm -hmm. Up air could do it. The purple. He's just saving that purple. He's not doing yeah. any attacks right now. He's keeping blue in the or uh, purple at the top of the lineup. Oh, but now we have blue. And now uh, we have death. With the grab right into the blue up throw. Yeah. Oh, oh that's the paper classic. He loves down air, dude. Oh, yeah. He will always move. down air off stage, regardless of if he's going to spike you or not. Oh, he got rid of that white as soon as he could. No, and I saw what I'm hip tried to do, because uh, I do this myself. It's like as soon as I take a stock, I start running off the stage and I just start throwing on more Pikmin. <laughs> yeah. That's why people hate you Olimar. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, uh, Olimar's uh, jab one is also, I believe, safe on block, and it's also safe on hit. Well, that's, it's like positive on hit, I believe. That's good. Because he does get jab, uh, jab grab set at 2 level percent. Yes, he does. Ooh, and, oh, taking it out. Yeah. Um, Just I'm, pointed his finger at him. Yeah, and I don't know if that was intentional, but like... Very rarely do you see two yellows in a lineup, and I'm hip got it twice in one match, and I think that's intentional because he knows that landing sucks yeah. with Olimar, especially against up air, up air, up air uh, game watch. Oh yeah, watch. so you mean you throw out the pick that has more priority so you can land. Yeah, down. yeah, he has more priority and a longer, like yellows are crazy. Like you see Shuton throw away yellows like it's like 
nobody's business. But yellows are actually really, really vital because they increase hit lag. Uh, they're just bigger in general, and they have that crazy arc. Like, I could be, like, I don't know how to, like, describe it for the stream, but I could be, like, right underneath the ledge, throw uh, a yellow, and it would just, like, curve over the ledge and just, like, stick on to anybody. So yellows are actually... Do they have different arcs when they throw them? Just yellow. Um, well, but they have different speeds. Like, whites are, like, fastballs. Right, yeah. You could, uh... I knew that for the white and purple ones, but I didn't know about the other colors. Yeah, all the other colors have the same trajectory, but yellows have that nice little arc. Really, really cool. Okay. Yellows are good. I forgot about this, but I'm here to actually won the last Wings Night Fight Coin all of his characters, not just all of ours. He went Ridley and Inkling as well. Oh, Ridley. I'm starting to have trouble with Ridley now. I fought a Sweet Tea on a stream, and it was, oh god, he, he brought the whole army on, on on me. It was bad. Yeah, but uh, I'm here actually is very proficient with this character as mm. well. Like, he's another really now. strong character too, so like uh, him having a, a good inkling in his pocket, not too bad for him. Mm. I wonder why, uh, well actually no, uh, I'm here likes to do that. He'll take the game with Olimar and then he'll switch on over to Duck Hunt, but now he's doing inkling. And right now he's getting up aired. Yeah, I really wonder how this one's gonna go. If, uh, if Paper's prepared for this matchup. Mm, I'm curious about this myself. And just a little weird bit of trivia. It looks like uh, it looks like Game and Watch gets all 3D when he gets ink on him. Oh, it just looks like it. Maybe uh, take take a good look at him. Okay, yeah, I right. do know there's like some moves that doesn't look like Game Watch because oh, ow. yeah, that was pretty nasty. That was a pretty even round one too yeah. for stock. Okay. It was, but then once he got caught by that roar, it was hurting. Oh, yeah. Dang, he's like lying up to get combo. Or he's like fastball, you have to get combo like double up there. That's really unfortunate. Yeah. I think two is actually huge. Yeah, I think two is huge. There's, there's paper, like, being so light. Yeah. Ooh, okay, the forward air's coming in. Oh, trying to stage spike with the, uh, the turtle. The toidle. You know what I think about it? This character definitely suits I'm here as an Almar player. It's another setup based character. Yeah. Just way faster. Yeah, much faster. You can be annoying. Uh, yeah. And it's also kind of like that that whole like extra damage type of thing. Right. Yeah. Game of Watch looks 3D when he gets paint on him. I don't know. What I, that? Kind of, I kind of see it. You know what I mean? Okay, but yeah, Inkling is at 164. We gotta take oh, care of that. Oh, there is another down air spike, man. Oh yeah. Paper's living for those down air spikes, but he's not living that up smash. Oh yeah, no, definitely. Another roller. Yeah, that little vacuum effect from the uh, up smash, just disgusting. Oh, just landing with the forward air, like you just don't care. Okay, trying to throw the forward air himself. Uh, Paper trying to cover some type of edge guard attempt. It looks like. I gotta say, I'm glad that we're seeing so many Inkling players, because uh, I was thinking of picking up this character, and the more I watch, the more I'm like, alright, yeah, if I can figure out the setups with the down B a little bit better, and I could definitely see myself playing this character. Mm, I see a lot more Inklings offline than I do online, surprisingly enough, but I, I still see plenty of them online, so. Really strong character. But, uh, Ooh, they're like missing. A, like another setup based character, really. Like, if you're really good at evading, like, the. Quote unquote, like kill setups in control to kill our kill. A fast setup character. That's that's actually trouble. Okay. Yeah, very giddy ass. Oh, oh that two frame? Bucko. Dang, that was so good. I, wow, I'm shocked. I'm actually shocked that went down the way that it did. Dang. Alright, uh headphones taking it. Wait, what?